Mississippi voters are sending Senator Cindy Hyde-Smith to Washington for a full six-year term. 12 News' Jay Belexa tells us Hyde-Smith won her re-election. Supporters cheered and waved signs as Senator Cindy Hyde-Smith walked into the Mississippi Agriculture Museum. Governor Tate Reeves told the crowd he liked the senator's work, saying she works for the three million people in the state, not just the metro. Supporters told me they like her conservative values. That I'm going to continue to work for Mississippians for all those things we care about. And uh, Mississippians sent a message today. They like the fact that I am fighting for unborn children, the Second Amendment, or the military. We're confirming conservative judges like Amy Coney Barrett. And that's what they like. That's the reason they're sending me back, and I'll continue to do that. Mike Espy, her opponent, raised more money than she did. Senator Hyde Smith acknowledges that. We sent the message that Mississippi is not for sale, not to outsiders. The people of Mississippi vote and they elect the people that they want to represent them. Hyde Smith has her work cut out for her when she heads to Washington. We're still in the middle of this pandemic. And we've got to work on the vaccines to making sure the quantity, the access to getting it out when it is approved. That's my number one priority is stabilizing the economy and making sure that we get this coronavirus. The only way that our numbers are going to come down is with the vaccine. And she hopes President Trump will be reelected no matter how long it takes. Jade Belexa, 12 News. Across the aisle, Mike Espy has conceded to Senator Cindy Hyde-Smith. 12 News political correspondent Gerald Harris was with Espy when he made the announcement. Mike Espy felt again against Senator Cindy Hyde-Smith. Uh, I want to congratulate Senator Hyde smith uh, on the victory tonight. I'm conceding. Espy hoped to become the first African-American senator since Reconstruction from Mississippi. We built an infrastructure. Uh, we built the bridge, and even though I might not be able to cross it personally, others behind me will cross it. SB says Hyde Smith enjoyed the help of President Donald Trump, who is very popular in Mississippi. President Trump did very well tonight. That was a huge turnout for him tonight, and I congratulate him as well. SB remained consistent in his feelings that Hyde Smith would negatively impact the Magnolia State. What she does is what she does, all right? So, uh, uh, in third and in word and thought and deed, I still believe what I said to you. I think she's holding Mississippi's back. Mississippi back. I do. Mike Espy says he will return to his law practice and for the moment stay out of politics. Reporting in Jackson, Gerald Harris, 12 News.